Things will fall into your lap when you've put in consistent work over a long period of time. Funny story, not too long ago, I got this voicemail that said, hey, call us back. We want solar. I'm like, oh, okay, cool. We call them back, set up the appointment. And I go over there and they're like, yeah, Kyle told us all about you. We want it. We're interested. Him and his boyfriend said that you were all super hot. We want the hot solar guy to come over and give us some solar, right? First of all, it's not like I'm that hot to where people are going to be calling all over the place saying, yeah, this hot guy come over to your house. And second of all, I still don't know who Kyle is. I don't know who this guy is, but I'm just rolling with it because I'm going to stop what's happening. So boom, sign them up. They're going to get installed on, I think, 21st of this month, coming up soon. We had the HOA. But again, I have no idea who Kyle is, guys. I have no clue. But anyways, I went over one of the easiest deals I've ever signed and now it's getting installed. Just this morning, I got a text from someone I signed up a long time ago in Texas. Their friend came over, saw their electricity bill. She texted me. She said, hey, call my friend. He wants solar sooner than later. I'm waiting on him to send me the electricity bill. It's just random stuff. But the thing is, I've been at this for years and years and years, going hard every year. And that's where all this stuff starts falling into place. So sometimes it's like the rich get richer, the poor get poorer, is upper spiral, downward spiral. But that's because once you've been building up your foundation, you've just been signing up so many people, you've been treating them well over years and years and years and years. You have all these people with solar all over the country. It's just now you start having random things start happening. Someone comes over. Like how many people are going to come over to people's house and just see solar panels go, hey, when did you get that? Oh, call Taylor. It happens more and more and more. But it will never happen if you're just half-assing it. If you're never putting in the work, you got to put in work over time consistently, day in, day out, week in, week out, year in, year out. And then I promise you it gets better and better and more interesting. So just put on the blinders, put in the work. Don't do half-ass shiny object syndrome. Just go for it. Get those exponential results. And all of a sudden you'll be having your own Kyle referring you to people that you have no idea who they are.